An exhibit showcasing a 75-year history and heroism of smoke jumpers is happening right now at the Springfield Museum. KEZI 9 News reporter Sarah Hurwitz is live now in the studio with a look at that exhibit. Sarah? Well, Brian, it takes a lot of guts to jump out of a moving plane into the burning forest, risking their lives to stop a wildfire from getting out of control. I spoke with one Vita man tonight who started jumping when he was just 19, and he's appreciative of the museum exhibit. This is in 1968 at, at Cave Junction when I was a, a jumper. And we, a wall of memories. Trooper Tom and myself in the Twin Beach getting ready to go to a fire. And pictures of a young Tommy Albert proudly standing next to the plane he daringly jump out of. You know, I didn't know anything about it, so I thought, well, that's a fire until the guys on the plane said, hey, bub, that's a going fire. It's firefighters like Albert who took wildfire efforts to new heights. Perhaps the most important and most interesting part of, of, of the exhibit is the, is the jumpsuit. Uh, largely unchanged for the last 30 or 40 years. And are the focus of an exhibit at the Springfield Museum. Get a real sense of where smoke jumping came from, uh, the very humble origins, and to kind of, you know, uh, personalize the story of these men and women who are heroes. Some of the harder parts of it were tree climbing, which is, which they would uh, make you go real high, and uh, because if you ever did land in a tree, you'd have to be able to climb the tree to get the shoot down. Everything from these jumpsuits, similar to what Albert wore, to these tools, parachutes, and airplanes through the years. And to top it off, a film at the Wildish Theater. It just seems like it's an actual to show a film here, uh, just a half a block from the museum. Two timely works of art capturing the job few would do, jumping into the fire like Tommy Albert did so bravely years ago. The first fire is always you're kind of somewhat numb, <laughs> but you get better as time goes. And that film is being shown at 6 o'clock on Thursday night at the Wildish Theater. It's free, but donations are encouraged. And we're told that Tommy Albert and several other smoke jumpers will be on hand to answer questions after the film. And the exhibit at the Springfield Museum runs through Halloween. Live in the studio, Sarah Hurwitz, KEZI 9 News.